ChatGPT 4.0 just released new features that are going to completely revolutionize print on demand and e-commerce. You can now create beautiful mock-ups without needing a photographer, without ever needing a model. You can now create designs from scratch, which you can upload to your print on demand supplier. You can even get help with your marketing. So if you are interested in learning how you can leverage all these new features so you can beat your competition, you are in the right place. In today's video, I'm going to share the exact exact step-by-steps and exact features that you can start leveraging. So not only can you have an edge, but you can create irresistible products that customers can't wait to purchase from you. So without further ado, let's get started. A feature I'm extremely excited about is that now you can use different images around the internet as references to help you create your own design for print on demand. Now it's important to note, you have to make sure that none of these images have IP or trademarks. A website you can go to is FreePick and in it you'll find a bunch of free images. You also have to make sure that they have commercial use. And also it's worth noting that when you leverage these images as well, you have to edit them as well accordingly. So let's say that we were interested and grabbing this floral design, what we would do is we would actually add this prompt and ask ChatGPT to generate a version of it that has a transparent background for our print on demand products. So I'm gonna go ahead and upload the screenshot from my computer. And just so we don't have to wait, I already do diligence so you can see how it looks like. And if we scroll over, we can see that this is transparent. So then all that is left for you to do is go ahead and download this image. Now, something worth noting is that then you can go back and create your mug or whatever product leveraging this image. You can also edit the design accordingly. So in this case, what I did is I, I did a collage by adding the image twice, but then we can also add text or any other elements to really make it our own, right? So this is just for the purpose of this video, just to show you what is doable. But essentially now you have the ability of creating designs by leveraging elements that are all throughout the internet, making your life much easier, especially if you're not a designer like I am. So it's gonna make it much easier for us to create our designs accordingly. So we didn't create an original design. So if we want to create our own original design, the good news is that you can now do it as well with ChatGPT. You just have to have prompts that are very precise. So let's say that we wanted to create a t-shirt design. Here's an example of a prompt that I would give it. Create a vintage style digital illustration of a bouquet of wildflowers in a whimsical boho fairy core aesthetic. The flower includes, and so I include all the different flowers, illustration type, etc. And by the way, if you're not sure as to what kind of prompts you can give ChatGPT, a very quick hack that I'm going to show you as well, uh, because this is going to take a little while to upload, is that you can actually go ahead and upload a design that you're interested in emulating on Etsy. So this is a design that I got inspired from. I'm going to go ahead and take a screenshot of this design. I'm going to go back to ChatGPT and I'm going to upload this design. And I'm going to ask ChatGPT the following question to help me create a prompt. I want to create a similar design. Can you help me create a prompt so I can recreate this style, right? And then it's gonna provide us with a prompt that we can use. So if you're not good with prompting, just know that you can do the same exercise that we did with the reference when you can take a photo of the reference and ask ChatGPT to create a prompt for you. Um, and so you'll be able to leverage this prompt. So in this case, it's still creating the image for us. It's gonna take a moment. Ta-da, our image is created. So notice it's not the same design, right? And this is important because this is our own original design. Now, I'm not a fan of how here it's cut at the border, so I'm gonna ask it to do it again. Can you please recreate it so that the image, the flower on top is not cut out and please, well, it, I did ask for a transparent background, so let's do that. So now it's gonna recreate it and you can prompt it as many times as necessary to create the design that you want. So if you wanna take out some flowers, you're simply gonna ask it to take out those flowers. All right, so you can see that we had the image of the flower being cut off and now it's no longer cut off. So you can ask ChatGPT to make updates so you can have the exact image as needed right you can simply ask it to recreate it and this is not just limited to apparel you can also do print on demand jewelry so our print is a print on demand jewelry supplier which i absolutely love 
and by simply taking an image of their necklace and then going on ChatGPT, you can ask it to draw whatever you want inside the necklace. So in this case, I asked it to add a minimalistic hand-drawn pencil tiger design on the necklace. Look how realistic and amazing this looks. And then what I did is I re-uploaded the design and I asked it to provide me with the tiger engraving design only in a transparent background with no necklace. So I can go ahead and download that and upload this directly on Outprint so I can create my own design. So needless to say, the days of having to be a designer are gone. It's much easier now to create design elements from scratch, leveraging ChatGPT not only by using references, but also by doing it from scratch. What is key is to prompt ChatGPT correctly and give it as much of a detailed description as possible. And if you're having a hard time creating those prompts, you can simply upload a screenshot from the design that you like and ask it which prompt you should give it to create your desired design. So it's all about prompting and doing a lot of trial and error to get the exact prompts needed for your design. Now we're going to do one more thing, ChatGPT can also do the exact same thing with text-based design. So we can also create designs from scratch with just fonts. And in this case, we're going to create a stylish quote design that says, live, laugh, love in a bold, modern font. And it's going to go ahead and create that for us. It's going to take a few seconds. Here we go. It created it for us. And then if we want to take out the transparent background, we can simply ask ChatGPT, please take out the background and create a transparent background. So we can go ahead and upload this to our print on demand provider. And here we go. Now we, all we have to do is go ahead and download this image. Now this next feature is one of my personal favorite because we know as print on demand sellers, we're really limited as to the kind of mockups we have access to. For this mug right here, even though we have some mockups in context, we wanna make sure that we have mockups that are a little different from everybody else. So something that we can do is actually download this particular image and then we're gonna ask ChatGPT to create a better mockup for us. So it could be a flat lay. I mean, the sky really is the limit here. So I'm gonna go ahead and upload this and I'm gonna ask it create a mock-up with this mug in a flat lay that is minimalistic adding some plants and shadow and let's see what it provides us now look at this this is not bad at all now I can actually tweak it around but this is a good start now if we go back to our necklace I did the exact same thing I took a screenshot of a best-selling necklace on Etsy and I asked it to help me create a mock-up with a flat lay that is minimalistic adding some plants and shadow in the background so this feels and looks high end and obviously you want to include whichever necklace it is that you are designing and now the best part which I'm going to show you I did the exact same thing but this time I asked it to put the necklace on a woman model with a white blouse shirt that is slightly open so we can see the design elements of the necklace and look how amazing this mock-up looks this is a completely made up model and really the sky's the limit so again this is all going to be about having good prompts and you can take screenshots of models or photography type that you're interested in replicating, uploading it to ChatGPT, asking it what kind of prompts you could use and then blending that with your designs by downloading the design that you created from the print on demand supplier and then going ahead just I mean exactly just like I did here right like I uploaded the design and then I gave it some prompts to recreate the mock-up I want to create and now I can play around and create different kinds of mock-ups right I can also let's say like create a mock-up with this mug a minimalistic kitchen with a white background um, and I could add some elements right I could add coffee in the background whatever that is so this is a revolutionary feature that allows us without having access to photographers or models to create our own mock-ups from scratch by just adding a few prompts like look at here it created for us a mock-up of this mug in a minimalistic kitchen with a white background and we can go ahead and upload this and upload it directly within our print on demand supplier so then these are images that we can use for our Etsy store, Amazon store, Shopify store, you name it.
Now we're not down here. As you can see, I created a different mock-up asking it for a similar mock-up, but showing a cup of coffee being poured into the mug. This looks even more realistic and I can go ahead and download that. Now, the next thing is you can also ask ChatGPT to create for you titles and descriptions. So in this case, we're gonna ask it to help me create Etsy title for this product, knowing that this, and you can actually feed it different keywords that you've researched through E-Rank or Everbee by looking at your competitors. So this mug is Wildflower Cottage Core Coffee Mug. Please include SEO rich keywords that will make it easy for customers to find this mug. And in this case, it's gonna provide us with some insights of SEO optimized Etsy titles that we can use. Now, what we can do as well, actually, because Printify has this feature now where we can generate the title with AI and we can ask it to generate it for us. And um, what we can do is kind of compare and contrast both titles. I would actually take out spring decor. We can compare and contrast Boho Wildflower Coffee Mug Cottage Core Flow. Actually, I like this title better. And then, so Printify has actually AI integrated now within their platform, and it also creates for you product description and will provide you as well with list of keywords. Now, the keywords are not 100% accurate, just FYI. It's always good to cross check, something that I like to do, for instance. So this mug is really popular. I have an extension like Everbee, so I'm able to see the monthly sales. And what I like to do is actually look at, analyze the listing and look at all the different keywords that they're using and you can actually copy those keywords. So Vintage Flora Mug doesn't have a lot of traffic. At least it gives me more ideas of the kind of keywords that I could be leveraging. So in this case, I'm gonna copy and paste, and then I'm gonna make sure that I add some of these relevant keywords um, in here so I can apply it to my listing. So I'm gonna apply all this to my listing first, and then what I'm gonna do is actually Coffee mug is too generic. I'm gonna do cottage core mug. Boho style unique unique mug is too generic. Mug gift ceramic mug is also too generic. So obviously you have to kind of like do your due diligence when it comes to identifying which keywords. But needless to say, like it's gonna make our lives much easier now because with AI, we don't have to create these product description and product titles on our own. We can do it all through the help of ChatGPT, making it much faster for us to upload listings. Like this used to take so much more time and now it's so much easier. So you can either copy and paste it from ChatGPT, obviously so you'll need to edit it accordingly to make sure that all relevant and it has all the SEO keywords that you want to include, or you can leverage what Printify or any of these other platforms have. Not all platforms have it. Another thing worth noting is that now essentially you have the ability to create whatever design your heart desires, right? So something that I like to do when deciding on which product I'm going to upload is simply get a sense of what is actually getting sales, which is why having Everbee is so important for any tool that's going to scrape Etsy. So you know what is actually getting sold. So summer gift, I like to use very generic keywords like summer gift, for instance. This is going to give me an idea of different products customers are buying. So I'm not pigeonholing myself to just selling t-shirts or mugs. And in here, you can see that these bird flower tumblers are getting a lot of traction. This was uploaded five months ago. Yeah, so don't look at the price. Obviously, this is like $3, which is probably why they're getting so much traction. Let's see, they have, yeah. So, I mean, a lot of times they're doing this because they know that their customers are gonna be buying these in bulk, but what you can do here is look for products that perhaps have a little less competition and that are getting a good amount of sales volume. So then you can create those designs. Personally, I love Outprint. Outprint has a vast product catalog of different jewelry that you can use. So like necklace, keychains, bracelets, etc. I really love Outprint and there's not a lot of sellers selling Outprint on Etsy. Printify as well has a really vast catalog. So what I recommend you do is do high level search so you can get an idea of products that are selling and then you go back and do those search with these print on demand suppliers to see if they provide those designs. But needless to say, now creating designs because of ChatGPT has been much easier than not creating designs with ChatGPT is much easier than ever. And like I said, you can also create titles and product descriptions and even help with your tags. So let's say which tags should I use for this mug? 
blog on Etsy and it's going to provide us with a list of tags that we can use. Um, 13 optimized Etsy tags and it's going to provide, and these are actually pretty decent, I would say. These are not bad titles. And then what I would do is that I would cross check with you either using E-Rank or Everbee to make sure that these have enough volume, but these tags are actually much better than the ones provided within Printify. So leveraging ChatGPT to help you create titles, tags, and descriptions, it's going to help you speed up your upload process and automate the entire process. It's definitely a game changer. Now, another pro tip is actually you can use ChatGPT to help you write Pinterest pins or even Instagram caption and even create special mockups for Pinterest. Like I asked it to do this by adding a model, pouring herself coffee in that mug that we created and look how realistic and how good this looks. And up here, I asked it to create a Pinterest photo pin. So it provided me with the title, the image pin design and the pin description as well. Now, obviously I might need to edit this, but imagine the time that I saved by having ChatGPT help me through this entire process from A to Z, this used to take hours upon hours. And now within just half hour to an hour, I'm gonna be able to upload my listing and have a title design that I created all on my own and have mock-ups that are unique from everybody else without spending hours on Photoshop or having to do the photographs myself. So needless to say, ChatGPT is a game changer. You have to start using it today. ChatGPT is only only going to get smarter. And sellers who start using it now, they are going to have an edge, which is why it's so important to keep up with all the different features and updates as they come out. So if you're interested in learning other ways you can leverage AI to build a profitable Etsy business, I have a free masterclass in it. I share the exact ChatGPT prompts that you can use to create irresistible listings that customers can't wait to purchase from you and how to kickstart your Etsy business so you can automate a lot of the processes. The link is in the bio and most importantly, if you have any questions or ideas of videos you want me to create in the future, make sure to add them in the comment section. I'll do my best to reply to each and every one of you. I'll see you guys next time.